This is a demonstration of the AP Payment and Apply Import from Precipio Services. Integration Manager and eConnect for Microsoft Dynamics GP do not provide an AP Apply Import. The AP Payment and Apply Import from Precipio Services allows you to import AP manual payments or credit memos, and it then allows you to import AP payment applications. Note that the application can only apply unposted AP manual payments. Now for a quick demonstration. Here you see I have the A Travel Company vendor in Dynamics GP with several open invoices. I'd like to import a manual payment and apply that payment to these open invoices. To do that, I'll launch the AP Payment and Apply Import application. I will log in using my Dynamics GP credentials. You'll notice that the application asks for a payment file and an application file. You can import the payment file and application file at the same time, or you can import those two sets of data separately. So before we select those, let's take a look at the templates. Here is a payment template which shows three different payments for the travel company vendor with three different amounts. And then the apply template, you'll see that we are applying the three different payments to six different open invoices for that vendor. So now let's select those files. I'll first select my payment file. Then I'll select my application file. And because I'm importing manual payments in this case, I'm going to choose create manual payments. You have the option of create credit memos instead and I'm going to create applications in the same step and I'm going to choose that I'm going to apply my payments. And I will click on Start Import and here it is importing the three payment records and then it is applying those three payments to six different invoices. So the import is complete. So now let's go to our vendor and take a look at those payments. So you'll see that the three payments imported, all for travel company, A1, B2, and C3. And if we take a look at this first payment for $204, the payment came in. And if I click on the Apply button, you'll notice that it is applied to invoice 1001 and 1003. Next, let's take a look at payment number two for $206. It is applied to invoice 1002 and 1004. And last, we have payment number three, and it is applied to invoices 1005 and 1006. And that's a brief demonstration of the AP payment and apply import. If you have any questions or if you'd like a trial version of the software, please go to www.precipioservices.com and click on the Contact Us link at the top of the page and provide your name and contact information, and we'll get back to you promptly.